Welcome to the Winter Fancy Food Show 2024. My name is Jennifer Coham. We're here in the press office, and I'm here with the fabulous Cindy. I'm super excited to welcome her to the show. We have lots of incredible, innovative products, and I can't wait for her to hit the show floor and discover all of them. Bye-bye. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here at the Fancy Food Show Las Vegas 2024. I'm excited to check it out what's new this year and follow my camera and let me show you what's there. Let's go! my favorite vendors. There's a lot of people here today. I'm gonna sample a lot of food. Try it out, check it out. Hi, I'm Robert Schuler with Melissa's Produce. We are the largest distributors of variety produce in the United States there. This is our first time here at the Las Vegas Fancy Food Show. And I'm gonna tell you whether the best tasting fruits and vegetables here in the United States, I would say currently right now is these Tasmanian cherries. This is from the island of Tasmania, right off of the uh, coast of Australia. These are the meatiest, juicy, um, bing-like uh, cherries that are available. We're gonna be sampling them in a little bit, but they're very spectacular. Coming up to Lunar New Year, uh, these Tasmanian two-pound box is a special box. It's a gold box. Really cool. First time we're offering it. Um, and the season is short. Uh, always January and February. So these are the cherries. I mean, these are better cherries than we get out of Washington, California, Oregon. And you'll know when we try them in a little bit. Next up right here, Japanese strawberries. Japanese strawberries look fake but they taste all real. They taste spectacular. We've got white ones, we've got red ones. We also have pink ones, and they come either in, a, they usually come in a nine count uh, clamshell, and they're kind of a little pricey. Nine Japanese strawberries, because they take so much pride and care in growing them, is about $50 retail. So, next up over here, we have uh, Melissa's representation of all the different varieties of grapes that we offer. Now, even though it is the winter time here domestically, we follow the season, so it's summertime below the equator. So we have some spectacular varieties, like the Shin Grape. We're also going to be trying the Shin Grape. These are from South Korea. That package right there, a little pricey, but it's a $20 experience for grapes. And they are the largest, juiciest grapes you ever have. They look like plastic, but they taste so, so real. Other, some other varieties we get from Chile, Peru, and Mexico that makes it through the rest of the season before we get to the California season, like our Moscato grapes, both red and green, candy hearts, cotton candies. Yes, these are the varieties that taste like they're cotton candy, and Melissa's was one of the companies that just started distributing them just about eight years ago when they became very popular for their name. So now they're grown globally, so cotton candies are much easier to get than they usually are there. So what we have here, these are crown melons. These are the jewel melons out of Japan. Um, they come in a box, they're so special, and you'll see the vine still attached to them. That shows that this, uh, when they grow these um, in Japan, hothouse, they deplete the vine of all the melons and leave all but one melon on the vine, hence the crown melon. They believe that all the nutrition and the flavor is condensed into this one melon. It's spectacular, but watch out, they're about $120 retail. But the, the tradition in Japan um, you know, as we, when we go to a friend's house for dinner, we, here in America, we love to give a bottle of wine or bring a dessert. In Japan, they really don't do desserts and they don't bring bottles of wine, but they bring a, a, a box or a bag of great produce item. And this is one of the more spectacular varieties called the crown melon. 
One variety that we're really known for, for a great tasty melon out of the Dominican Republic, are the Charente melons. They're a personal size melon. They look like they're cantaloupe on the inside, but they are the sweetest and tastiest variety, and we carry them not um, year round. You don't have to wait until summertime to enjoy them because the, the, the positioning of, of the Dominican Republic close along the equator has the temperate, not too hot and not too cold weather that's perfect for these melons. And then coming over here, here we have our spectacular display of pineapples. Pineapples has been a big growth market in the U.S. market. We've got uh, what's been around for quite some time, these cute South African baby pineapples. These are baby pineapples you do not have to share. You just have to remove the skin. The core is so sweet, it's entirely edible. But down here has been one of the most spectacular varieties that um, we uh, are one of the few distributors with Del Monte that does the pink pineapple. Yes, it's a pink fleshed pineapple. And the difference between a regular pineapple or baby pineapple and a pink pineapple is the fact that they have they have no the acidity. So people who've had pineapple, it's like a love-hate relationship. The acidity is, can bother their gums. Because of the lack of acidity that the pineapple has, it's a super sweet variety, and yes, the whole interior is pink. But the newest pineapple, this, there's been a big pineapple craze, are these Ghana pineapples from Africa. They're called the um, Elefante Gringo Pineapple. This is out of the Sugarloaf Pineapples because there's only two true natural colors of pineapple, that being a white and your typical gold varieties. These two are very similar to the white pineapple in that they have the low acidity and super sweet. They do look a little funny in the marketplace and they'll fall over, so typically now you'll find them in our Melissa's box uh, for these Elefantes. So look for them in your stores very soon. But here in the Las Vegas area, the chefs love working with the baby pineapples, the, 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 the pink pineapples, pineapples, and now these white pineapples. And so these are just some of the spectacular um, fruits that we're um, showing and talking about here at the Fancy Food Show for. But, you know, stick around. You'll, I'll, I'll be more than happy to talk about any of the other stuff that we have coming up, whether it's for Luna. Hi, everybody. I'm Jesse with Enjoy Snacks, and we are at the SFA show. This is our booth. So we're a local company um, located in Hawaii. So we have hard candies, we got gummies, we got candy lei, which is really popular in Hawaii as a tradition of showing love and aloha. So we have our tropical Hawaii hard candy collection that just came out this past summer. There's eight different flavors, lychee, mango, melon, and the list goes on. Down over here, we have on our beautiful spinners, we have our candy lei. Um, really special, really bright colors. A nice way to celebrate your loved ones during graduation or birthdays, things like that. We have a gummy pineapple one. This is one of our best sellers. We have good luck ones for Lunar New Year coming up. So strawberry and pineapple. And then our two chewies, which are really pretty. My personal favorite, because I, I love the colors and the pom-poms. So this is a guava chewy and a pineapple chewy. And then on the front, we have our gummy side, if hard candies is not your thing. So we have our 3D gummy collection. Um, the really cool thing with uh, these is that like a gummy bear is flat on one side. Um, these ones, we use a special mold to have the texture all the way through. So if you take a look at like, this is our Maneki Neko. Really cute kitty, it's called Lucky Cat. You can see it in local businesses um, to bring good luck and good fortune. So these ones come in lychee, plum ume, and pineapple. And then our gummy pineapples and our lychee. Two favorites. Stuff that I love that's in our backyard in Hawaii. So come check it out. Thanks for... Hi, I'm Vic with King Cheese, and uh, I'm a producer of... Uh, Smirrella Minis out of California, Los Angeles. We do the uh, Armenian string cheeses, King's fetas. We got fetas with different flavors. And uh, we got all our meats and cheeses. And our meats we brought, bring in imported from uh, Casale uh, in Italy, in Parma. And uh, this is what we do. And we love and have passion. And we handcraft all of our products and meats with a uh, passion of our heart. And we love doing what we do. We're here to provide and uh, help and serve our customers who we love and adore, and thank you so much. 
Hey, my name's Phil Hemmings. I'm with Ross Chocolates. It's a company started by a guy named Bob Ross, not the big hair painter Bob Ross. Our Bob Ross was a chocolate tier. He worked with high-end chocolates until one day he got diagnosed with diabetes. Frustrated, turned around and figured out a recipe where he can still enjoy quality chocolate without screwing around with his blood sugar levels. And so 27 years later, one of the best-selling sugar-free chocolates in Canada and hopefully soon to be in the U.S. So hello, my name is Luciana and today we have here Stari, which are Peruvian hot sauces. They're pretty new. Um, they're very unique because they're made out of peppers that only grow in Peru because of our microclimates. So even if someone tried to grow them somewhere else, it's kind of impossible. So as you can see, they're like, unlike any other hot sauce, they are really creamy. Um, textured, they're not like the vinegary or watery, uh, and they're not like that uh, red and that spicy, so they won't actually overpower your food's flavor, but enhance it. So yeah, great. Hello, this is Steven from Postmate. We're a company located from Taiwan. All our products is from Taiwan, and we have three different branches located in the U.S. One is in California, one is in Texas, and we have a new one that's in New York right now. Uh, the, the, more, the specialty for our products is our flavors are more authentic, but we also add a twist to it. So for this year, for the classic milk tea with traditional boba, we added the ube puff powder that can stick around the cups and then it makes a new decoration, but still with the original taste. This is our booth. Hi, I'm Buddy Crowley. I'm with Euro Pastry. I'm here at the Las Vegas Fancy Food Show, and uh, I'm here displaying our original Pop Dots. Uh, these are excellent, new, unique, and innovative line of products that come in all different sort of shapes and sizes. Uh, we have minis, we have large, we have filled, unfilled, and one of the really unique things about this dough is that it is, it is half fermented dough and also with a cake dough with an excellent line of different colors for all of your uh, customers and your, uh, all your business needs. So thanks for stopping by. Here. So we have some chicken eggs and quail eggs. So this is uh, soft boiled eggs and um, the sh shelf, shelf life is uh, four months and for the quail egg it's 12 months in room temperature. Wow, it's pretty unique. Yeah. So for the chicken eggs we have three flavors. Uh, the original one and then uh, the big with salt and then third one is uh, abalone sauce. And then for the quail eggs we have soy sauce and then chestnut and uh, salt baked. Yeah. Thank you. Hi, welcome to Winter. And so we actually are coming out of retail very soon. We have a six pack of poached eggs you can just buy. Hi, I'm Moda Gupta. I'm the founder and owner of the uh, brand Brook 37, the Atelier. We sell the rarest and the most exotic teas. We bring them straight from the garden and we pack them immaculately and we call ourselves the Chanel of the teas. And our goal is to elevate the tea experience to a fine wine uh, drinking experience. So as the alcoholic beverage consumption is becoming something that not, not a lot of people are excited about, we want to introduce tea, a very fine tea, which is very similar to a glass of fine wine because of the provenance story, the flavor profile, the complexity, and that tea leaves have exactly like uh, grapes, and we want to uh, promote that. And this fine packaging actually helps us promoting the overall experience to a very luxurious experience. We are a 90% woman team. Our teas are plucked by women, packaged by women, and uh, every other function is led by women. And that's not by design, it's because I found the best people to be women who are in these areas. Um, we are also um, uh, plastic neutral. We are one person by the planet certified, and we donate 2% of our revenue for social and environmental causes. Our, our, all our packaging is uh, biodegradable or reusable. 
and uh, we have beautiful gift boxes and our um, package design got Penta Award nomination uh, this last year in 2023 and if you take a look at our tea bags they are biodegradable and they're really large size so that the teas can brew nicely inside these tea bags. Hi, it's Mimi at Get Cultured Box. Here's our do-it-yourself pho kit. It has everything you need to make a nice pot of pho. Noodles and herb bags and seasoning. Bye. Hope you Hi, how you doing everyone? This, this is Steven. I'm from Success Import. I'm going to introduce you our famous ugly cake. A lot of people are surprised why well, we call this ugly cake. Because, you know, they look like they're too good, but the taste is really good. So we call this ugly cake. The meanwhile, we had a presentation for the egg tar. We made it the tar cake mixed with the egg tar into the egg tar cake. And also, a lot of people, you know, in the show, they're like the shape of the banana cake. We made a cake exactly like a banana. You can peel the skin off like a banana. So this is kind of famous. Hopefully everybody gonna like it. You guys wanna try some dumplings? Oh, Hello Las Vegas, uh, this is Kamada Suisus and we have Dashi Suisus, this is the best seller in Japanese market and try to enter the market in the United States. Thank you very much. We are Shoda Shoyu from Guma Prefecture, Japan and we are a soy sauce company uh, in Japan. <laughs> this is our gluten-free soy sauce. And we also have, uh, yeah. <laughs> Which one's your best seller? The gluten-free soy sauce. Uh, this is made from rice instead of wheat. Mm -hmm. And uh, it has a very like nice taste. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yay. You wanna try? You wanna try? You yeah. have to try. I mean, this one. Okay. This booth is for Shime, um, which is a rice uh, manufacturer company. We actually a joint booth for a little bit. I'm from Authex Sushi Robot. Uh, he's from Fujimac, the rice uh, rice cooker company. Uh, we're working a little bit in tandem. Um, we got premium short grain rice from Japan cooked inside the Fujimac rice cooker. This is actually a rice cooker uh, seasoned with one of the best sushi seasoning on market from Mitsukan. And once that's all seasoned, Rice goes into the machine, and with the press of a start button, it gives you a clean cut rice sheet. Very flat, very easy to handle. Um, with that, the chef comes in with the seaweed, sticks it to the top, and you can pick up the whole thing. Wow, just like that. Just like that. Wow, thank you. Wow, look at those strawberry. It's a what is uh, what kind of strawberry is this? We call this. This is called tamayuki. Oh. Tamayuki means uh, soup. Uh huh. Okay. Wow. Thank you. Hi. Hi. What company are you guys with? Uh, oh, and this is the real wagyu. Real wagyu from Japan. So uh, here at French Feast, we're the exclusive importer and distributor for Chocolat des Français, which is a company started by uh, three art students uh, in Paris. And um, these exquisite uh, bars are, they're all organic. Um, and you'll find them in places like the Museum of Modern Art and in uh, hotels such as, uh, French hotels such as Sofitel. Um, we're very happy uh, to be working with Chocolat des Français because uh, they consistently produce new styles and they have, uh, for example, these are the Easter eggs this year and um, they're constantly coming out with new packaging and um, such as this, which is uh, chocolate covered uh, cereal balls and they also make chocolate covered nuts like almonds, hazelnuts, more. Thank you. So this is a hot taste chili garlic made in Japan and a brand new product. And please try. Hi, 
this is Dong Wan, and this is a Korean product, and we're selling these through JFC Company, and we have three different flavors, which is the spiciest, and then the uh, middle spicy, medium, and this is a cheese, so Poke, this is very popular if you like cheese. And we also have the fire bowl, which is like bulldog if you like it. And they're trying to sell this, but we don't have samples this year, but this is very popular as well. This is the seaweed chips. It comes in original and the, uh, the shrimp flavor. So whichever fits your um, needs, go ahead and get them. Thank you. Hello, I'm Carla with Galaxy Desserts at Brioche Pasquier. Today we are presenting our macarons. They're all imported from France. We make about a million and a half a day. Um, we're co-branding with Emily in Paris. That's popping out in about a month and a half, maybe two. Um, we have a new product. It's called our Cointreau macaron. We have lime today. It has the Cointreau filling. Um, and then we garnish those on um, champagne or margaritas. And we do dessert flights with our pedophores. And um, they're great. They're all natural flavors. And you have to stop and get some. Thank you. Hi, we're Angel Slumi and Truffles. Uh, we're to here at today at the food show. We have a whole variety of products to show you guys. We have five game meats. We have elk. We have duck. We have some wild boar and venison. We have some bison as well that's not here with us. Uh, we have an indigenous product that is unique to our company, which is some wild boar salami. Our company is the only one that produces it in the United States. We have an award-winning black truffle salami with 5% truffles, which is almost double more than our competitors. And you can clearly see all of the truffle pieces inside of it. It is absolutely divine. We're the first company in the United States to be able to get a gold medal in France, which is a huge deal it's like a uh, food landing on the moon but in France so it's pretty cool the ordeal we also have some black truffle and white truffle butter right here it was absolutely delicious and it's great for pasta basting um, or you just want to put on some mashed potatoes it's ready to go it's perfect thank you yeah no problem welcome we're at the uh, kill sauce booth at the uh, winter fancy food show 2024 um, these are my line of hot sauces they're all natural clean ingredients flavor forward and just recently, as of the last month, non-GMO verified. The labels got will be updated very soon, but we kind of focus on flavor, like I said. Uh, this is our uh, top seller, our habanero. Just a very clean, natural, all-purpose um, habanero hot sauce that kind of works for every palate. Not too hot, uh, just right. You know, right down the middle. And uh, definitely try it out. Hi, my name is Brandon, and this is Holland American Food Company. And we're exhibiting here at the Fancy Food Show with some of our most famous products, the Jossie Chocolates, the Windmill Cookies, and the Strope Waffles here. Hi. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good. Good. Hi, we are Wagyu Ninja. Okay, we came here from Japan. Yeah, that's our dream to make the Japanese cuisine more affordable for the all US citizens and for all, all the world. Yes. Hope you will enjoy it. Yes, we have a good ninja. Hey, come here, come, come here, come here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's our team. Yay. They're real ninja. They're, they're dangerous ones, so be careful, yeah. Camera all day. Hello, hello. We are Mary Max, and we're so excited to present to you our newest brand, Scoot Frozen Lemonade. What's fantastic about Scoot Frozen Lemonade is that it is lemonade in a pouch. It's great. It's on the go. You can have it for camping. We have it in three awesome flavors. As you can see here, we have strawberry, original, and peach. You can visit us at hayscoot.com. We're also available on Amazon, and we are excited to announce our national distribution here at the Winter Fancy Food Show. Cheers. Wow, look at this size. Two-year-old country ham, no smoke. It's just pork and two years of getting fun. Thank you. Hey, welcome to Spilt Milk, the best tasting chocolate milk in the entire world. 90 calories, 20 grams of protein, zero sugar. Critics are calling it, critics are calling it freaking delicious. You're going to want to try this coming out March. Save the date. 
Linda, Jacob's Southwest Specialty Food. We're exhibiting here at the Fancy Food Show in Las Vegas. This is our newest release item, ass kicking pretzels. This one is jalapeno cheddar. We also have hot and spicy, bacon ranch, spicy pickle. We produce over 200 items, hot sauces, salsas, Bloody Mary mixes, chili mixes. Thank you for looking at us and have an ass kicking day.